Welcome to the Luka Project. If you're still with me, congratulations. You have reached the third and final act. In this episode, we will be covering the use of color in filmmaking. We see color every day. In filmmaking, color is used to set the tone of the story. It can be used to set the overall feeling of the narrative or show symbolism. In Star Wars, we can see the use of color symbolism throughout the franchise. Jedi are perceived as the good guys and the Sith are the bad guys. To illustrate this, Luke Skywalker, the protagonist, wields a blue lightsaber. The blue represents the good light side and the color itself portrays calm and peacefulness. Elegant weapon for the more civilized age. Darth Vader, the antagonist, wields a red lightsaber. Red represents the evil dark side, thus portraying anger and passion. There are no rules when using color in film. Colors are subjective, meaning that they can portray multiple things. However, sticking to a consistent color scheme is important. There are three factors when using color. Hue is the color itself. Saturation is how much of it, and brightness is the exposure of it. There are infinite combinations with these factors to set a mood, and these factors can make up a color scheme. Let's use blue as an example. Blue can set a serious tone because of its cooler appearance. Having a low saturation can make a shot look gritty as opposed to having it vividly. With brightness, you can make the shot look dark with a lower exposure as opposed to more lively with higher exposure. Going back to Star Wars, in the battle between Luke and Vader in Episode 5, the blue mist behind them sets the fearful tone of the fight. Another example use of blue color grading is The Dark Knight. Having that low saturation complements Batman's dramatic pursuit on the Joker. In contrast to a cooler color such as blue, warmer colors such as orange or yellow can portray harmony or peace. While red is used to symbolize anger, it can also portray love or warmth. Green, another color, can set a corruption tone in a film's narrative. An example of this is the beginning scene of 8 Mile. We're introduced to the protagonist, B. Rabbit. Having that color grading foreshadows his journey of finding his self-confidence and his struggles with the harsh environment around him. Green in The Matrix is used to present a futuristic high-tech dystopian world since it is commonly associated with technology. Color is limitless. Again, there are no rules, no boundaries, and how you can portray things in your narrative. All that matters is establishing and showing the feeling of the mood. Well, I have something that, well, that belongs to you. How do you have it? Well, that friend of yours, one of ours, gave it to me. And I've been reviewing the schematics of this beautiful, beautiful thing. I think it's absolutely amazing. It's quite lovely, quite amazing. And I think, uh, well, could net you nearly millions of dollars. And for us, well, the government, we can profit off of your creation for wars, protection, etc., etc. And I think you should work for us. So what do you think? <laughs>